you to fam what's going on hey this is your boy mac got souls coming at y'all with another video how y'all doing out there today i hope everybody is having a blessed day my day is going pretty good it's saturday i can't complain nice weather outside man went to my son's soccer game today day one so congrats and salutes to my son's school for that but um, anyway, before we get started today, man, y'all make sure y'all go like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, man, so that y'all know when Matt got souls bringing y'all some more sneaker content, right? Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Man, anyway, um, today I want to do something a little bit different. Uh, I'm not bringing no sneaker review to y'all today, um, but what I wanted to talk about is a few sneaker essentials that, you know what I'm saying, I use um, to keep my sneakers clean. You dig and um i know in my videos i talk a lot about how i keep you know what i'm saying my sneakers clean i don't mean to brag but it's just something i take pride in man that's all but um yeah to get things started off um one of the products that i did mention um before i believe that i use to clean my sneakers is crep um shoe cleaner and if you guys don't know what that is that that is the black bottle right here Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. I'm so sorry. But yeah, this is crap, man. This is, um, I believe this is an eight ounce bottle. The ultimate sneaker cleaner. Cleans leather, suede, new buck, canvas, nylon, uh, vinyl, and many more. Um, this has a great uh, smell to it. It's another reason why I like crap. Um, this is a, a eight ounce bottle I got off of... Uh, off of eBay and that's what the bottle looks like in case you guys are interested or um, sorry about the glare man I got this light on but um if you guys are interested in the shoe cleaner you know want to try some different crepe it's, it's pretty good like I said I ordered this bottle right here off eBay like a little eight ounce bottle um but originally um it comes in a pack like this um, you can go get this from your uh, local finish line or Foot Locker or whatever. Um, has crep written on the front. And this little casing, man, you open the little casing up. Um, normally, it would be a little four ounce bottle of a crep shoe cleaner in here. Um, and then you get your Michael uh, fiber tile. And then you get like a medium, medium bristle brush. You know what I'm saying? That comes in this little package, man. So um yeah crep is pretty cool um i also use jason marks but i don't i don't have any of his products on hand okay but uh yeah i, I use crep crep is good you know what i'm saying it, it 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 suds up nice man and it really gets a deep clean on the sneaker um again um here i have three bristle brushes i got a uh, hard bristle medium and a soft you know what I'm saying? It's important to have uh, different choices of brushes, man. Because when you're hitting them, them, them soles on them sneakers, man, you got to go with the hard bristle brush. You know what I'm saying? To get them soles clean, man. Because some soles be hard to clean and you really got to get down in there and put some muscle, put some muscle behind it, man. But yeah, you got to have your soft bristle, medium, and your hard bristle brushes, man. Got to have those, okay? Um... Another thing I like to use on some suede is the the eraser. I use this on my Timberlands a lot. The eraser and then the uh, the brush. And I also use this uh, eraser on the uh, Jordan 11 Platinum Tints. Works pretty dope on those. You know what I'm saying? Works pretty dope on those. Anything, not anything suede, but most new buck. You know what I'm saying? Um, this works pretty good on, man. Um, takes them little stains right up out of there. So yeah, the eraser, suede eraser and a brush, man, is another thing. Um, to protect my suede, I like to use Angelus Mink Oil. I'm pretty sure a lot of sneakers head, sneaker heads have heard of uh, Angelus Mink Oil, man. Pretty dope product. I love this product. Um, works very well. And it's not that expensive either. Good focus right there. Yeah, this is not that expensive, man. Probably like 
probably like 12 bucks on, on Amazon or something like that. Uh, suede, waterproof, um, and conditioner. Also, like if you're cleaning your suede and you know what I'm saying, the, you know what I'm saying, to get a little faded out or whatever, this Angelus, you know what I'm saying, will bring back some of that color on the suede, man. All right, now, um, I also have some rejuvenator uh, wash pods. And uh, these aren't the rejuvenator bags, man. I ordered these off Amazon. I think I got a set of like four of these, you know what I'm saying? Put your shoe in there, throw one of these pods in there in the washing machine, man, and you good to go. You did rejuvenator. I don't have a whole cleaning kit, man, because the prices can get a bit steep. But you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, is I I heard that it's worth it. You know what I'm saying? I heard it's worth it. So, um, what else we got here? What am I missing? What am I missing? Um, oh yeah, right here. For um, you cats out there that um want to try to re ice your soles or something like that, I use Angelus. So bright product. This works great. This works great, man. As long as you got those uh those UV lights and uh you got your saran wrap, you know what I'm saying? Um this is a way you can take the uh, the uh deoxidation out of those um you know out of those clear soles, those translucent soles that we love so much, and also um salon care. Um, I've actually tried this product too. Um, it doesn't work as well as the Angela Soul Bright, but um, this also uh, works on translucent soles, you know. So, Salon Care uh, 40 volume. Uh, I believe they had a, have a 50 volume too. Um, some some states they require you to have a license to even order this stuff, man. So, um, yeah, though that's uh, something I use to uh, take the deoxidation out of my uh my translucent soles man and uh gotta keep some microfiber uh tiles on deck you know what i'm saying you can never go wrong and have too many of these man so uh yeah y'all make sure y'all get some of these too but um yeah man um little video i wanted to touch on man uh, some sneaker essentials that i keep you know what i'm saying stored away for my sneakers to keep them clean man and looking good you know um I like to try different type of brands, man. I also used to use MGK. Um, I rarely see that product anymore. I probably can get on eBay and find it, but they used to be in the middle of the mall all the time, man. Um, somebody walking through with sneakers on, they on you, hey man, let me clean them sneakers on you. They might not even be dirty, but they just wanna test their product out and get you to buy it. But uh, yeah, they, they got me, man, and I was using that product, but I try to stick to Crep and Jake, uh, Mark Jacobs, you know what I'm saying? But uh, to each his own, man. You use what you want to use. I just wanted to bring y'all that little video today, man, to show y'all what I use to keep my sneakers clean, man. And I, I do a pretty good damn job at it. You understand what I'm saying? I still do have the uh, uh, the mystery box sneaker cleaning coming for y'all, man. I did have to order some new sneaker cleaner. Um, so I'm gonna get that video coming out to y'all with me and my daughter cleaning her sneakers off. You understand what I'm saying? But until then, man, y'all make sure y'all go like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so that y'all know when Matt got souls, bringing y'all some more sneaker content, you dig? All is well, all is well. Well, look, y'all continue to enjoy y'all Saturday, man. I'm gonna go on and get up out of here. Until the next time, y'all stay blessed, all right? Peace, love.